Welcome back, everybody. This is Rampant, and welcome back to my Kingdom of Scotland campaign for the ship Mod, where we're going to continue the left off from last time, crushing the remnants of the rebellion that we had spawned in the last video, where, just wonderfully enough, uh, my king here, I think it's because you had shit going on for you in regards to your authority as to why the game decided to have to give us a rebellion. I was like, right now, if I go through, let's see, I need to see if you have... It might be because you had too many traits on you. Usurper. No, you actually didn't have... Um... Yeah, no, because you only have the seal one. If you had multiple, that's when they start getting upset. But you only had the one. But now, your uh, authority is actually back up pretty high there, so we should be okay. Also, did me losing that land straight up destroy every single watchtower in that area? That's new. Huh. I have never had that happen before, where me losing the region actually destroys every watchtower that was originally in the area. That is interesting. Okay. But we are going to need to try and have it so that we can get rid of these rebels that are around here. So what I'm going to do is a lot of the remnants that I have, I will try and have it so we'll gather them together and get rid of them all. We go there. Uh, you can also help out, get rid of these rebels. Oh, they're just going to run all the way away. Okay, well, let's have you go there and there. These guys are pretty easy to kill. Take that out. <sighs> Not lose 100 fucking guys for that. Yeah, merge those guys together. All of you too. And then I think for the most part, I don't see anything else really going on uh, besides what's up here. So I think that let's take these forces that I have here. I'm going to grab you guys, put you on a boat. And what we're going to do is, oh, first, uh, well, the, the bishops can stay. I do need to send you over to the Holy Land. But for right now, I'm going to take these guys, drop them off up here. I'm going to use you to get rid of all of these rebels that are around here. Then we can probably disband these forces and continue trying to build ourselves up a bit more. Um, so I'm going to have you keep trying to stab people here and here. Keep trying to train you guys. Also, I still want to try get this guy to kill himself uh, at some point because um, I'm going to try and put him out of his misery. So let's try and send him over here. So it's a little bit closer and you should be able to fight there. Um, I do have a, a new family member here in the form of you. I might actually have you stay here because this guy's getting pretty old. He's 54. You might not last that much longer, and I can have you kind of watch over the city. I do want somebody to build watchtowers around here again, because it looks like... Uh, no, there's actually some rebels on top of that. That actually might be why I don't have any vision right there, is because of that one specifically. So, I'll keep trying to send my guys around, trying to get rid of these rebels. And hopefully, uh, you'll die, and we won't have any more uh, rebellions, hopefully. Uh, I am about to get over... where are they? Here they are. Because right now... We're still trying to send reinforcements over here. Right now, we are going to be focusing a lot of our attention over into the Middle East. I right now want to take some time and just build myself up around in France. So if we can, I just want to keep doing that. So Reims, I'm going to have you, I would say, grab a better farm. Let's grab the better farm here. You can grab that. Uh, is there anything else? Oh, cool. Claremont can get something. Claremont. Uh, I'll have you get the Stonemason's Hut so we can reduce uh, construction costs. Uh, Rozon, uh, still, mm, you can't grow right now. Uh, I don't have any other ge extra generals that I can recruit around here just yet. I did actually have one up in Lincoln. So, I'm gonna grab you. I'm gonna have you be picked up by this fleet next turn. I'll send you over here to try and be the governor of this region, and hopefully that'll make it so that area is happy. Um, also, I do actually have a princess here, which I think, let's see... Do we want? I can, we could can, can use them for a couple reasons. Either more seduction of just random generals, or we could try and have it so that instead we try and uh, use them as just a straight up diplomat. I kind of want to try and see. Oh, actually, let's do this. I'll send you over here. I want to try and talk to this you guys. If I can get you guys to be my allies, I'd actually really appreciate that because I don't see us going into Iberia. I think we're going to kind of ignore that. A war with the Holy Roman Empire might be down the road at some point, depending on how things go. But for right now, we're trying our best to just keep them off of us. So, we'll keep training assassins, and I might even try and use these assassins at some point to try and get some of these areas to maybe rebel over to me. Like, uh, Loven, I can see this area possibly uh, breaking away to us, possibly. Oh, hello! Uh, you guys want a ceasefire? I am gladly going to accept this. Uh, I don't think I'll be able to get any money from it, sadly, though. You guys are currently bankrupt. 
I'm only at war with you right now because Leon decided to attack you uh, and your fleets, and I was right there to help out. So I'll gladly accept that. I would have liked to get some money from them, but with them being bankrupt, I don't think we're going to get anything. Oh, I'm losing a lot of money. Okay, um... Well, oh, damn it, that's why. Play here, that's making me lose some money. Um, okay, well... I lost. The point of you guys coming over here, losing I'm not going to care about losing how many men I lose here. I just need to kill you. Get rid of you, Scotland. merge them together. Uh, it's a little bit better, 2700. You guys, come on. Fight me. Um, put this down to 2700, 2500 loss. Ah, uh, shit. What more can I do to reduce the amount of money we're losing? Oh, I've got all these guys still, too. Um... You, and you... And you... Honestly, just get rid of all of them. Because that brings it down to... We're losing money still. We're not positive. And those are my main mercenaries. I've got some mercenaries in here, too. Um... These guys as well. 500. Basically... Uh... I'll just get rid of all of you. Just get rid of all the mercenaries. Then we'll be making money, but I'll still be in the red. So, probably, you're gonna be disbanded and you're gonna be disbanded. Um, oh wait, no, 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 please don't disband my other units that are actually good though, cause like, these guys are technically mercenaries. I'm gonna hope it doesn't disband all of them? Please don't. Um. Okay, let's slowly move, make our way over here. Is there anything I could do to get a little bit more money? Um, if I could win this right now, God, I'm losing so much money here because of corruption. Not corruption, because of uh, devastation. Twenty nine hundred devastation. We're almost here, but like, okay. Is there anything else I could do? If we make a little bit more money, let's see. Those been general's bodyguard. Uh, that's you. Let me get you over here. Uh, and that was a retrained unit, right? Or was it a recruited unit? Because everybody's free upkeep. Uh, you guys are upset right now. I don't see... Uh, it's free upkeep, free upkeep, free upkeep. I could get rid of some units in this army. Yeah, like, 600. Because I need to make it so that the next turn amount we are positive. So we get rid of you and you. That's barely enough. I think that's it. I think that'll be enough. So that you guys are okay. I was. I basically just don't want to lose my crusading mercenaries. That's the main thing. If we don't lose them, then we're fine. Um, you then. Uh, I'm gonna keep sending over this way. This one poor bastard is still trying to make his way over there. Okay. So I think we will have averted disaster from uh, losing all of our men. Uh, and as soon as like you guys are also done and you're dead too, then we're not going to have to worry as much. But hey, uh, next turn we'll be over here. We'll be able to drop off on down here, help reclaim Sis, which does make a decent amount of money. And then that is what I'm actually going to start trying to push in here and start conquering more. Because I'm losing so much money because of you. And if I can bring this crusading army to go deal with them, I can very easily start making some more money around here. Okay, we're still- why are we still in the red? Oh, it's gotta be, uh, the other stuff, though. Uh, damn it. Now the question is, how many disbanded? I'm making 18,000. Wait, wait, whoa, 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 whoa. Oh! I, my liege. Okay, um... That's interesting. So, um, my heir's dead? Or who, 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 the person who was my heir? Um, yeah, he's dead. He died at sea with the entire fucking crusading army. Oh, that's painful. Okay, well, I'm now making 18,000 gold per turn. Um,. So that's something. Um, Agnes, who who the fuck are you? Do I care, I guess, is the question. Uh, no. 
Because I'm still trying to have more family members over here, but like, that that's interesting. Uh, let's see, my new heir is this guy. He's the one that's just chilling up here. Oh, why do I still- I Oh, you guys are still making us lose money. Uh, okay, well, next turn we'll have plenty of money. But this is so painful that we got lost all of that. Norwich Finish some Roads? Hey, that's cool! That's cool, but doesn't fucking help me! What's so fucking ever? I love that. Okay, um, again, I know Move there's, yeah, there's a rebellion army over Aye. here. Because of how much money we're losing, I don't care about how many men we lose there. So yeah, there we go. Now I have more vision. Okay, so. It was just that. You can make your way over here. Try and have it so some of you will be free upkeep around here. This area is really pissy. Please don't rebel. I can't repair any of this. Um, I have nobody I can bring into that area quickly enough to be able to actually garrison the region. So we're gonna have to hope that it doesn't rebel next turn. Please don't have that spawn like another rebellion if it does. Oh, man. Because I could send... Well, actually, I can do this. I can send you over. Okay, that's enough to stop it. That is enough to stop it for now. That's good. <sighs> Fuck, I'm... Uh, hopefully you guys don't just sally out here. If you sally out now, this area is fucked. Uh, or at least you won't be able to win that. Uh, not with what you have currently. Um, I... I lost so many units. Why are... These guys are considered mercenaries even though I recruited them from the city? Interesting. I don't... I kind of dislike that, but okay. It's, it's something. For the okay, let's try and talk to you now and see. Can we get an alliance with you? I can do no. Okay. So, I just can't. I just can't. Okay, there's just nothing I can offer you guys. Well, I'm going to try and steal one of your sons Hi. then. We'll try and do that. Ah, oh, man, I don't like this. <sighs> Keep stabbing, uh, please. Keep training until you guys are just maxed out again, because right now, how are you guys doing? Let's see, so, these three guys, ooh, you're at eight, you're at six, and you're at nine, ooh. Who needs a second smile? Do I have any spies down around here? I have you. Yes, my king. Let's see, 75% chance. I want to just check and see the city. And he's dead, okay. Because I would love to get at least these two settlements to kind of try and join me, if anything. So I'm not opposed to trying to burn down those areas to try and get them to want to rebel and join me. We'll have to see if that's going to happen if my own uh, country doesn't Im fucking implode right now with how things are going, at least at this rate. You need to keep being dropped off over here. And then I do need to send you over to this area. You'll try and be the governor of that region and hopefully grow it up so that it start getting the population to grow so we can actually do more in that area. I am pleasantly surprised you guys actually didn't attack me over in the east. Um, ooh, propose this prince's hand to uh, Feradach the Malevolent. Ooh. So I'm gonna pay a handsome dowry. Um, and I'll get some military units. So, oh, you know what? No, why not? Why not? I'm gonna get some military units. Uh, technically, your person I don't want to actually have reproduce, as you're on the family tree that I don't care enough about. But you know what? I'll send you over. All of you marry him so that we can get some troops. Why not? Uh, Death stocks the land still. Hopefully that goes away soon. Uh, to train or train those guys. Also, give me another spy. Ooh. My urban spear militia improved. Ah! Oh. I'm actually gonna want to like slowly merge and replace those guys then, because they're slightly better. They're more expensive, but better. Hmm. Would be a better garrison troop though. That that is a better unit, because I've got more men in the army and they have higher defense in general. Like, mm, that's not bad a unit. Yeah, so I'll slowly try and get rid of, replace those guys. Um, on that right now, let's see. So over here. I lord. Again. <laughs> this guy's slowly. Oh, he can't even. He can't even move that way. He can't move at that angle. I'm so sorry. Like I'm trying to put you out of your misery, man. But like you're just not getting there. Uh, are there any other rebels around here? No, there's some down here though. All, all of you guys go over that one. Move out. We march. So let's try and bring uh, you over here. I'll send these spies up here to try and slowly reduce them down if they can, down to a smaller amount. So I can try and go there, and, can report, and then what I need to do is we need to start recruiting more over in the east. So, I'm again, I, I'm surprised you guys didn't just sally out of here, because at the moment, uh, this is not the best army. I am going to start trying to now, we want to start expanding over here. So we need to actually have some more troops. I'm definitely going to be trying to use these guys for sure. Uh, who else do I want to use? So many of these guys are expensive as fucking hell. Um... 
Spear Militia, you're good for garrisons at least. I'm trying to train some still. Oh, I do want to, don't forget to repair that. Repair that. At least get one of these guys, or at least merge, and then just retrain that guy. Um, and I will try and get, honestly, like, you guys are not a bad unit. I need more cav around here, though, if anything. If I was going to get any cav, and get another general who's bodyguard, which honestly is not a bad idea to have around here, especially since you're about to get, uh, about to die. You're also doing, <laughs> you're a coward. Love that. Okay, I would say, honestly, if anything, I want to get these guys, these heavy javelmen. Are a good combo. They've got a good amount of damage. Melee attack is a little bit lower than these guys, um, but they do have that range component. So I'll grab you as an infantry unit. We're gonna slowly start building up some forces around here. I have, it's gonna take a lot longer because we lost our entire Crusading army, but eventually we will be able to build uh, actually expand around here. So for the most part, all these areas over here are doing really well. I do make sure to keep building watchtowers over around these areas occasionally. So like right there, and then go back into your own land. And it'll be now, there we go, now the area's growing. So it's growing up at 1% per turn. That's something at least. Let's keep trying to do that. This area is not growing, but I can actually get some stuff around here. So I would say get the bakehouse. Uh, I don't want to use up too much of my money. Orleans, I would say uh, you guys are a little upset. Um, you don't have to worry about conversion. Growth, though, we do kind of want to have. I would say get the bakehouse here, too. Uh, Paris, let's have Paris get, uh, I think this is more growth. Yeah, get the better, uh, let's get the better blacksmith there, I'd say. Hello, Portugal! I will gladly accept some trade. Having to pay you a little bit of money, I guess, is fine. Uh, you guys are doing... You're actually at war with my allies, though, which I don't like. Can I get some map information from you guys? I want to get a better update of what's going on. Um, offer me money for my map information. Sure, I'll accept that. I'll, I'll, I'll take some money. Basically makes up for the amount of money I paid you guys. Don't get any map information, but you just I just gave it to you. You guys seem to be still surviving over there somehow, at least. Ah, there's another civil war that ended, too. It seems like I'm not the only one that's been having civil wars, at least, so I feel a little bit better about that. Uh, Great Fair, you know what? I will offer that. Uh, also, I don't want to forget that you guys here... Uh, did I drop off? Oh, the agents are here still. Okay, so... Um, let's go over here. We're just trying to get rid of these rebels. Um, and then what I want to do is I'm going to take these guys now. I think that's good for my fleet for right now. I will say just the one ship. I'm going to take just the one vessel. I'm going to bring these, God damn it. bring these guys over to the Middle East. Your job is still trying to make your way over here. You'll be dropped off there to start helping conversion. You'll stay here to ferry things, but I can have you guys here, kill them, okay. Now the rest of you guys, I actually think I'm going to disband you. Uh, I'll just get rid of all of you, besides maybe, well no, even my spear militia though, I can use different ones, because like you guys actually have access to better spear militia over here, that I do want to, actually, I mean, well what happens if I just retrain? Uh, no, I was hoping that maybe it upgrade the unit, sadly it doesn't. Okay. But all of these guys here, though, I, I am going to disband you. Just so we can make that excess money, and I can put it elsewhere. Because right now, our primary focus is kind of over here right now. We're slowly trying to recruit more troops in Kesari. I'll keep trying to get some more men. Um, grab some more infantry here. Uh, these javelmen as well. Eh, these guys aren't as good as these javelmen, so I think I'm going to avoid those units. These guys, the Foot Knights, will always be a really good unit. Uh, they also cost nothing to build! So let's grab some of you. Because basically I want to have it so that uh, Sivas will be our first target, I would say, at the moment out of all of these. Um, you are... Okay, so this area is doing better now. Major report, faction announcements, card nominations, ambiguous, social drinker, monk, overseer. Not bad, okay. Uh, construction report. You guys can get, let's see. Over here, uh, you're still slowly growing. Uh, does the inn actually give any growth right now? No, it does not. Okay, so... Uh, this also gives... Oh, this actually gives population growth. Oh! I didn't realize the church actually gave pop growth. Okay, nice. So yeah, grab that. Ooh, that's another reason why I might actually want to eventually get uh, a better chapel around here if I can in Ruin. I can't right now, but eventually I will. London, kind of same deal. Because I want to still make sure you guys are growing. I would say... Uh, let's see. That will give some, and it's also cheaper than this. So let's grab that first. Perfect. Okay. Uh, on that, let's see. Lincoln... You can get some more growth, I would say. Also go with the monastery. Uh, that doesn't do anything. If I go with that, though, it will. That's actually quite a bit. 
Okay, so let's have you grit the well. York is growing. Uh, lower the taxes so it grows even faster. It's going 2.5% uh, per, per, which is not bad. Okay. You guys keep trying right. to stab this guy. Right there, and right there. And then... I hate that you just literally can't go at angles. Soon, this guy will be put out of his misery as I send him over here. He's getting there. He's almost there, man. Let's see what is going on here. Cotton report. How actually? How am I doing with the Pope right now? Cause I'm not at war with anybody. Uh, it's still pretty low. Um, I can, wait. Can I have another diplomat yet? Yes, I can. Uh, can I get one right over here? Uh, Paris. Yes. Um. I'm going to grab one of these, I'm going to send them over to Rome, and we're going to have them start trying to bribe the Pope into liking me. Because I need to get him to like me, that way I can actually try and make sure I ask for a crusade the next time. Because I really want to- oh, aww, he died. Because I really want to make a target uh, be over here to help us out a little bit more if we can. A rebellion in Lithuania! Man, there's a lot of rebellions going on recently now. Also, how much money am I making per turn? 20,000? Oh, I love that. Also, I do need to make sure that, again, around here, uh, keep making sure I have more spies and assassins. Uh, I've got this diplomat now. You need to go over to Rome. It'll be there in about three, three four turns. I can have you start trying to talk to the Pope and start trying to bribe them to get them to like me a bit more. And I do want to try and see if I can get this area to rebel back over, rebel over to me. Um, I don't have a spy over here right now. I want to ruin. At your service. Uh, actually, yeah, I've got you. You can't get over here this turn, but I can bring you start bringing you over that way. Sire, so you can start bringing you over there. Uh, you guys still need to keep stabbing this dude. You and you. you. Keep slowly bringing over the ugly. He's almost there. Uh, keep doing that. And then let's see. Who else do we have for my agents? Just get you. You're good there. Uh, you can almost get... Oh, you still can't get that too, but make your way up this way. Who else? Oh, I've got one in uh, room right now. Uh, can you get in there? It's got a 75% chance. Basically, I just want to see what buildings... God damn it. 75% chance and you still fail. Um, I just want to see what's going on over here and see what public order they're actually at right now. Yes, my, uh, yes, my Just so I know how likely it is that they're going to rebel. Do you want dead? And that's it. Okay, so that's all we can do for there. I can stab you, but I can also try and burn things. As long as I don't kill the... As long as I don't assassinate anybody, I can freely burn as much shit as I want and get away with it. So that's great. So again, just keep training these guys here continuously. Um, that's just uh, following that agent, I believe, now. Faction announcements, construction report. Um, let's see, so the blacksmith here. Uh, do make sure to repair everything first. Repair everything, and then uh, we're still trying to focus on growth for right now. So actually, uh, as this doesn't give any growth right now, that'll actually give it back. Okay, so yeah, just repair all that stuff right now. Don't build anything else at the moment, I would say. Um, Gand, though, I will say for you. Um, probably the local guard. Get some law bonus there. We don't have any corruption around here, which is actually surprising that this mod does not have nearly as much corruption. So you should, you should be okay. Then I need to have it so back over here. Uh, two more turns until this area gives up. I will take it. I'll just keep focusing on recruiting around here. So we'll keep trying to grab more guys. Uh, I'm going to get some of you... And then, actually, we don't have a... Oh, actually. If I can look at that unit again. Got some of those spikes. Got spam in here. You know, I'll grab them. I guess you're pretty badass. I will grab them. Um, and then, honestly, after that, we'll probably just grab stuff from around here locally that is uh, mercenaries. Because there's actually quite a bit around here. An enemy to and if I took out pretty much all of you... They are... Uh, Damn it! Joining uh, our forces. They're 50%. Uh, how many of you have to stay here? Like, if I have these two stay... No, still not enough. Is this area still just so pissed off? Distance to capital is 50%. Unrest is 3,000. Um, I could move my capital even further east. I could put my capital in, like, Dijon, but that might not be enough. I think these areas are just going to be unhappy for fucking ever. Uh, I don't have any spearmen that I can recruit around here. Uh... Well, we got some more time. Otherwise, would it be fine if he's one that's still in there? Yes. So, I could have the coward be the one that actually makes his way over there. But once you die, that means his entire area is going to be pissed. Uh, let's try and get a different general. 
also. At the moment, this side of the family tree, I hate is still not doing going anywhere, but I could possibly get some men of the hour and actually join these guys into the family tree by marrying these women. I don't know if they're going to actually have any kids though right now, because like, you still haven't. Traylon still hasn't had any kids, and you've been married for fucking ever. You're now of age, but you haven't been married. Um, on, ooh, actually... I know you gave me a mission for this, but I think I'm gonna have a marry his cousin if I can do that. Yes. Cause I don't want that guy. I want so. Uh, where is that kid of mine? He is currently in. So he's in Carnivon. Would you be able to marry him? Of Scotland. I can't tell right now because you can't actually get to him just this turn. But that is something to try. Try. Because hopefully one of you on this side of the family tree uh, continues to have uh, kids. Because over here, uh, people are just randomly dying or they're having just daughters at the moment so far, it seems like. So that actually gives me a lot of opportunities to like try and have you guys remarry into the family tree. Oh god, I might start just inbreeding my fucking family. Ah, uh, it's fine. What's the worst that could happen? Let's see, you guys. Oh, you can't grow that right now. Is there anything else I can build right now? Because, like, you guys... No, you're still not growing. York, still have to wait. You guys have to wait. Norwich can get something. Norwich, all of you grab um, the Stone Mason's Hut. I'd grab that. And then all of these areas are constructing something. So, that's about it. And how long is it going to take you guys to get over here? If you guys keep getting stuck, it's probably going to take way too long. But I would love to be able to have some priests over here, since I can't actually recruit them over there. Uh, you guys are now stuck. Wonderful. Okay, well, let's see. Next turn, at least, you guys are about to surrender there. I've got more men here, so next turn I'll have some more. Um, let's see if any of you guys don't suck as a governor. You guys are all idiots! You're unintelligent. Okay, you're normal intelligence. You are fit for office. Um, I don't want to have you try and move into my family if anybody did. I'm probably just going to have you stay around here to watch over the area, honestly. Oh, actually, for now, uh, let's go up here for a second. So if you get a watchtower around there. I actually make a ton of money now. I can actually build up some watchtowers to watch over these areas. So I kind of go there and right there. Um, slowly but surely, things are recovering here. I'm going to have you grab... Um, I should grab some more of these guys. Try and grab some more men there so we can try and use them as maybe garrison or... Because um, I need to make the area happier, honestly. Um, let's see, we've got the bakehouse built up over here. Let's see if you get the better deep wells as well. Um, Ruin, you could get the siege work. Eh, why the fuck not? At least build something. You guys are actually a really well-developed settlement, so I might as well keep you up in tip-top shape. Uh, Orleans, um, I'm gonna start getting the stonemasons and logging camps and stuff. Let's grab that. And then, that is everything else, because you guys are all just repairing now. Okay, you can kind of hold off on that. Now, can one of you just get in here so I can see what's in the city? Stop dying! There we go. Now I can actually see what I'm burning. So, this area here, it's at 105 per quarter, actually. Ooh, it's not doing that hot. So, if I was going to try and burn anything, City Watch could get rid of 10%, 10%, uh, 10%. Not a lot. I, I was hoping there'd be something that was doing more. Like, you're doing 5%. So, honestly, it's probably the City Watch. That will be not ruined soon. Did you succeed? You failed. Okay, well, let's try and have you do that again. 72% chance, much better for this one. There we go. Yeah, public order's down to 85. And then I did get another assassin in Paris. Although, actually, uh, get rid of you first. I need to try and train you up before you start trying to burn things. So get rid of that. Uh, that is maxed out now. Okay. I'm going to have my other spy. Let's just kind of watch, walk over here. Kind of explore some of these other areas. Kind of get some more vision on the Holy Roman Empire lands. Um, you guys here... Uh, trying to train those guys if you can. Nothing else really to build up here. Uh, I would love... Actually, I need to remember you. Eh. You're almost there, my man. Almost there. It's like, like, one, two, three, four, five turns there. Because we're going to have to go into the city. I don't think it's going to let me go around it. And then how are you guys doing? You're doing okay. You're doing really well. I think I'm actually going to grab you, bring you back down this way. Because I'm about to have it so that my princess... Now, can I have you marry into the family tree again? Let's see. Yes, I can. I can have you marry him. 
How shall I rip Let's let's marry I'll have you marry your cousin. Try and have him start having some kids, because somebody fucking has to eventually. Hello there! Uh why are you attacking my little random dude on his own? Let's see what's in this army again. Uh it's a cav unit and a trebuchet. I think you can win this. I'm gonna fight this myself, honestly. Because the horse archers, if you get into melee with them initially and you get a good charge in on them, you should actually do quite a bit of damage. Although this is just a general I recruited, so I'm not gonna care too much if he dies, but I'm gonna hope he stays alive, as I do need more men over here to be able to just keep control of this area. Let's try and, oh man, that's kind of in the way a little bit. No. Oh, please don't hit me. Please don't hit me. I'm gonna hit the horse archers. Get in melee with them. Don't let them just really shoot you. Because you should, in extended combat, win this fight. Yeah, a third of them are dead. Don't care about the trebuchet, primarily. Just focus on the cav. They're more important. I just need to get very lucky and make sure you just don't die. Although, I don't really care if this bowl cut guy dies. Because, man, that is a sad haircut. I'm sorry for you. I've got like 12 guys left. Uh, they almost have almost all of their the cab dead. Goes Eight, way. seven. Let's pray it a Let's see, there's three artillery pieces. There's nine of them and nine of me. We should. Oh, this is really close. Come on, man. I believe in the bull cut. I was just dissing the bull cut, I, but I believe in the bull cut. Come on, man. God damn it! <laughs> My lord. The tide of battle seems to have turned against our enemies. One victory from man thieves in the night. got away. Will not be so One fucking man got away. Okay. I see. I, I shouldn't have dissed the bull cut. Maybe he would have survived if I wouldn't have done that. But uh, at least you killed some of them, at least. You at least put up some watchtowers around here so we have a bit better of an idea of what's going on the western side of that. Uh, assist! Okay, so you guys are now going to sally out of here. Okay, good. You guys are taking a lot of damage, so this should be relatively easy to deal with. Um, you know, I'll deal with myself on this. And then let's exterminate it, because I want to make sure that this area is happy, so we can actually move out of here. Because Casery, honestly, I might want to try and exterminate its populace at some point, to make sure they like me. Because this area here, they're, they're not that unhappy right now, actually. Um, I can't build anything whatsoever, but that's fine. And they'll grow up uh, by like 7% per turn. Um, so let's have you again. Keep trying to get the stonemasons up. Over here. Let's see. So, right now... I kind of don't mind trying to use you as the general to actually move out. So, like, if I take you guys out of here... Uh, probably leave behind you. Leave behind you, you and you. Just make sure that the area's happy. Because, like, if he's not in here... They're so pissed off. So as soon as you die, your your uh, Anatolian kingdom is just gonna come crashing down. But ooh, ooh I see a fight I want to do. So I've got about uh, I want to grab. Let's see, you're technically a horse archer. You're a melee cab unit. Same thing. So grab these two, and then we've got uh, you, 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 you. We've got one more slot. I'll grab you. Then if I go into the bridge here. Are there more mercenaries? Just, no, just those two. Now, will you guys actually want to attack me here? For their lives soon. March. A lot of infantry there. A lot of infantry there. Do you guys have stakes? I I'll have to check in a second. Um, part of me actually... Uh, well, I'm going to have to just trust you. Uh, the coward, Mayor Brissin, uh, Brissin, the coward. Let's test you out, man. I want to see if we can finally expand out here. It's taken a while. Um, but now we can put all of our time and money into expanding over here. I would love for us to kind of start slowly building up a Anatolian kingdom. Um, this is a... in our favor. From such what the fuck is this shit? What is this for? A, this is a poor excuse for a river. What the hell? This is supposed to be a bridge battle. Well, um, okay. Not what I wanted. I've got some decent archers, so maybe I'm fine? I I have no idea. We're going to try and take this hill up here, so all my units make your way over here. Over here, guys. Start the battle, because I've got all of you guys here. I've got a decent amount of infantry, I've got a decent amount of skirmishers as well, so I think for the most part we should be okay. It's just irritating. This was supposed to be a bridge battle, that's why I fought it. 
is because it was a bridge battle. So let's have you guys just go like right here and right here. I'll then grab my cav and for sure try and have you start trying to make your way over to harass them. Uh, javelins, let's have you kind of go... Eh, I'll have you be considered one of the infantry units technically. Let's kind of group you guys up. Kind of like right there, right there, and right there. And then the armies are pretty small, so if I have all my melee cav and all my cavalry in general kind of start rushing over here, I can probably harass them enough to get them to rush over to me. I have to hope that my men don't break, since you have no fucking command. That's my hope, at least. Uh, they're good quality units, at least. They're, they're, none of these are bad units. So ideally, you guys will be able to hold... Oh, actually, they're starting to run over with a couple units already. Ooh, okay, okay, okay. But I'm going to try and make my way over here. Let's see, go here. <coughs> because let's have it so um, some of the Turkish archers right here I'm going to have you try and charge there there start trying to hit some of these guys from different angles you can kind of go in the back line there horse archers try and do what you can to unload on them and let's see if there's going to be enough to get them to try and rush over to us the Turkish archers are kind of exposed. Ooh, careful there with the trebuchet. Go up here, guys. You try and hit that trebuchet there. Melikav charging on in. 3% in that initial charge. Not bad. I'll try and pull you guys back here again. I'll take you guys pull back too. Don't stay in extended melee combat. We just want to get an initial charge to do some good damage. 6% of the enemy army is dead there. Our men are winning okay, let's have the you guys pull back. If we continue like this, Horse archers we as well. The enemy. I think that might be enough to convince them to charge at us. So let's kind of pull back over here now. Okay, 7. Got a decently favorable trade there. Let's keep kind of running away. Go back up to the trees. They do seem to be chasing us. Oh, that one is another horse archer. Are they going to follow? Because I'm going to try to have my melee cap go over here. Try and get you guys to finish off this horse archer. And then they do seem to be making their way over to us. Although maybe... Hold off, hold off, hold off. If you can pull away, I'm going to have you run for now. Because I don't want to keep trying to fight them if I don't have to. Although this one is alone. I can very easily kill this one unit. These are Turkish archers that... Oh, they're isolated away from the rest of their army. Ooh. If you're going to do that then... Yeah, waste your ammo on the trebuchets. Some of my male knights. Uh, let's have you make your way over here to hit those guys. Everybody else... Try and hit this Turkish uh, horse archer. And let's see, these guys. Just no damage. Yes, the 12% of the forces are already dead. The battle is you guys come back down this way. If we hit them again. True and steadfast, victory will be ours. Not the worst. Hopefully, this gets rid of your coward trait. I would not mind if I can actually get rid of your coward trait here. There you go. Now they're coming into the fight. Okay, so now what we'll do is after we're done with these skirmishers, I'm going to try and t deal with this trebuchet. They are making their way up to my archers. They can be in there. Oh, hello! Please don't sh shoot me a point blank range. Almost killed my general there. Because that did hit his unit bomb. Okay, so get rid of the trebuchet for now. Enemy is making their way up. The horse archers are getting their asses kicked so far. You guys are currently winning that fight. Because at the moment, they're kind of ignoring me. So I can kind of just hit them in the back line here. Have you guys keep writing these men down. Blinds 420. Not bad. Some of their melee cab is making their way back here. I prefer to not fight that if I don't have to, so if we can, I'm going to try and run away from this. As I want you to get in range of my archers. Be shot at by them, and then I hit you in the back with my cab. So right now you have 4 to 21. Just trying to get a little bit closer. So cab kind of go over here right now. But so far, my guys haven't shown any uh, signs that they might break if they uh, hit you guys in melee. Ooh, you guys can hit the general right now. How many of you can hit him? Specifically the bodyguard. Basically everybody but one. So all of you so focus down that general's bodyguard. He's the one guy I'm really concerned about. The other army is led by a captain, so I'm not nearly as concerned about him. Uh, these guys are all the infantry, so just kind of... Uh, we're not engaging just yet, but just stay near them so that we know we can charge them whenever they start committing. Okay, enemy general's almost dead. I'm gonna have you guys start trying to charge on in here, and let's get rid of these skirmishers of theirs. General's bodyguard, he's down to three guys. Um, then it's just a bunch of infantry, who, once they actually commit to a melee fight, I will very easily be able to break them all. I just need you guys to actually commit Our to that fight. Are winning the battle. 
If we can we still have this like heavy cab unit, though. Smash the enemy. If you guys can, make sure you don't fight it for right now. Okay, pull back again. I'm gonna have all my archers try and focus on that heavy cab unit now. Uh, melee cab is starting to break. Oh, uh, that's not good. Try and get a horn blast there, try and raise morale. Gotta pull back. So I'm a little worried if that other cab unit starts fighting you, you guys are gonna get your asses kicked. They did charge into melee. Not all of them, though. Decent amount of them died there. Pull back for right now. Okay, there we go. You guys recovered. Okay, pull back up here. Because the general's bodyguard's almost dead. I think we can kind of ignore him. Just having my archers try and focus on the heavy caveat. You're almost dead. Okay, let's have you guys kind of pick your own targets. Pick your own targets. Now it's just a free-for-all. They are starting to kind of commit. I'm going to wait until they start charging into melee. Then we can start just hitting those guys and running them down. Because they are starting to break. Melee cap, let's start trying to hit this unit here. There we go. Is that Good the captain? The yeah, no, that's not the captain. That's the name general. There we go. So, will you guys now just break on me charging you? I'm hoping so. Yep, chain routes are uh, glow. Uh, uh, oh my god. Chain routes galore. They have lost there half the men. Start running them all down. Infantry, same deal. Just start rushing forward. At this point in time, the enemy has lost so many men. They are just running for the hills. And they are failing so far. There we go! Now, if this doesn't get rid of your coward, cowardly trait, I don't know what will. As you won this battle very handedly. And now, we are going to be able to just walk on in and take another settlement around this area. We should start getting the Pope to fucking like me more! Because hopefully I don't have to bribe him that much. I know my diplomat is making his way over there, so we can start trying to just bribe the Pope to get him to love me again. Um, love me, Pope Daddy. Oh god, that's so wrong in so many contexts. Oh god, why did I say that? Oh god. I would cut this out if I could, but I already need to start at spit. I'll, I'll, I'll sit in my cringe here. I'll accept my fate. Fuck. I deserve to burn in hell. God damn it. Let's see, I'll execute all of you guys. Sivas is now under our control. Uh, I can just walk straight on in here. You're still the coward, seriously? After that fight... Okay, exterminate the area. Just make sure that it's happy. Uh, again, start with the conversion immediately. That's our first top priority. Um, Turkish archers are recruited around here as well. Okay, not bad. I would love if you could actually uh, recruit priests around here. Let's see, churches. Oh! Okay, so it's just castles can't recruit priests. Oh, okay. So castles cannot recruit priests, but cities can. Good to know. Because otherwise, this is going to be a pain in the ass to conquer over here. But no, now that we've got that, that's good. Let's see what else we got around here. Um, Yeah, you were the one that guy that died during the end term. We don't care about you. Um, Dijon just finished their carpenter. Let's see if you get the stonemason's hut. Let's see. Uh, Caravan just got the better farm. I'm going to have you get the better site hut for some more uh, reduced costs. Monastery in London. I would say... Um, there's not a lot of corruption around here. No, there's not. Uh, I'll just keep getting more public order stuff. I'll get another medical care unit. More health bonus, conversion, happiness. Why not? Across the board. Um, recruitment report. That's just all in case three. We already know about that. Uh, other than that, also deceased. This is worsened. Why do you not like me? What the hell? Why do they not like me? They're my allies. Weird. Also, over here, I should probably actually get some men over here to watch over the city, so let's get you guys to be free upkeep, uh, to make you like me a little bit more. And then, uh, you will be two more turns until you can get over here to I marry him. To them, let's see, uh, assassin, keep trying to train here. And then you, yeah, you have to go into the city. Next turn, you can keep making your way over there. You're almost there, my man. Uh, assassin, drop you off on the boat. Drop you off over here. Keep trying to train you. Uh, um, over here. Yeah, because that's what we'll do. Once you guys get to nine, then basically I'm like, okay, now we can actually send you over to try and burn things. So let's say, uh, Town Hall. I wonder if there's a way to help increase the chances of heretics to spawn in an area. Does that maybe happen if I destroy the church? I'm kind of curious, because I'd love if there was a way that I could do that. You like me more? Oh, they like me for the, uh, me exterminating Sivas. Good. Is worsened though. Eh. Why don't you guys like me? Like seriously, it's probably because of the extermination. But hey, Kaya, it gets infidels. Like you guys should like me for that at least. Ooh, a new beauty in Scotland. Oh, where's this beauty? Um, let's see. Uh, Bathan. I don't think we want to add to Bathan. Also, you're fucking sixty. 
Faction leader's old. You, this is the second time you've told me. Is he gonna die soon? Is that why you keep telling me? Because, like, I know he's old. He's 72. Why are you the killer now? I'm just, Oh, it's probably because of the assassins, honestly. That's probably why. You are most certainly now senile. Interesting. Beyond battle. Tyrannically, you're master of assassins. God, you are not a nice person. <laughs> you are not... A, you, overly generous. And then also just... Inst oh, God damn it. Same on the side of the same point. Um, it is detected over there. Okay, so I am being attacked here. I don't have a lot in this area right now, so I'm actually kind of a little concerned. Um, it's a little while until you guys are happy around here, so if I take out... Let's see, like if I take you out here for a second, let me check something. Um, I can grab these horse archers. This area, if I lower the taxes... That's even with a full stack army, they're pissed off. Although... If I get the public gallows, that'll add like 30% here, so you should be okay. Conversions are already already gonna suck, so not gonna worry too much about it. I think what we'll do though is instead, um, let's the leave fight? these two guys behind, Onward. and then grab all of you, Aye. and then the I can hit that army. So put you guys in to see us. Uh, should oh, no, it's gonna be pissed. It's gonna be pissed. Well, that's fine. I, I need to kill this army here. Because you guys here, a uh, pretty March. shitty army. Do you have no calf? Oh, they have no calf. <laughs> oh, you poor bastards. Um, honestly, I don't think you need to do anything. Like, he could. Do you really need to? No, not really. So I'll, I'll actually command them myself specifically. Um, I don't, you know, I will have it just so you guys are on the map and you are more threatening. Um, this entire army, as soon as I kill their general, is going to break. They have no cavalry. They have, what, what was it, two archers and then some trebuchets? Like, this army should break, like, just fold like paper. So, let's start the battle. Group up all my skirmishers. And then my cavalry. Group up all of you guys. Uh, this room. And then my infantry. So, let's start the deployment. And then I'm gonna have it so honestly, like you guys go there, you guys go here, you guys go here. Archers. I'm gonna have you guys kind of move up a little bit, but like, like right there. My reinforcements are not even gonna be able to get here in time. Wow, that's a lot of trebuchet fire. Be at my cab. Let's move you in a little bit closer. Basically, I need to have some of you. First type priority is gonna be trying to hit the trebuchets. So like you, you can go hit the trebuchet immediately. You guys. Kind of just go over here. Just kind of hold for now. My other cab units are the ones that need to go hit the trebuchets. So hit this one first. Archers are opening up. My infantry. Keep trying to move forward a little bit, like right there. Melee cav. Kind of just pull back. Hold back for the most part right now. Uh, until I know where their captain is, he's somewhere in this giant ass blob. Uh, I'm going to ignore him for the most part. I'm going to get my infantry into melee if I possibly can. Because like a lot of you guys actually are doing okay. I'm surprised by that. If we remain true oh, actually, there's the archers. Fast, victory okay, will be let's ours. go over here. We're going to try and go around and hit that archer. Because as soon as he's dead, as soon as they have no captain, they're going to start breaking. Archers doing just amount of damage. 10% are already dead. Uh, you're not supposed to be fighting. Do not fight that unit. I'm going to go over here. And then you guys need to go for this archer right here. So I'm going to go around. Try and kill him. I'm going to get these cab units out of here for a second. Because they're starting to fight my men in melee. I'm going to try and... Let's first get them off of the other trebuchets. We've gotten them off of one. I need to get them off of the other three. Because they are just opening up. They're doing some decent damage to my archers. I do not like. And he's now dead. So now, for the most part, the rest of this army should break pretty easily. Let's get you guys to kind of run on over here. Break those guys down. And they'll start charging into... Oh, actually, a lot of them are starting to break already. Okay, Cav, again, like go here, hit the trebuchet, there, 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 you guys are also hitting the trebuchet from the other side, please break this unit, you shaking broken, there we go, okay, I'll start having you guys try to hit them, infantry, I'm gonna give you guys AI commands at this point, uh, melee Cav, try to hit this warrior the unit right here, badly bloodied. 8 they have lost their not men. bad, you need to start causing some massive chain routes here with you guys. There you go. 968. It's not bad. 
All those. Here we go. Now she's wrote them down. There we go. See, I didn't even need uh, Gile Minashel to join on in. Also, he's now the battler. I like that. That's the first time I've seen that trait. I, I'm hoping that uh, you will eventually get something better than the coward, as at the moment you've been doing fairly well for yourself. You're going to be probably the man that takes over command of the f wars over here as soon as uh, my... Technically, it's my character, as if I'm viewing it this way. As soon as he dies. Because I haven't been able to have anybody on the Stanley Tree um, join in on us just yet, still. Still no man of the hours. That's fine. But, now I need to make sure I have to go double-check. I should have just gotten a new uh, princess. Where the hell is she is the question. Because we should have just gotten a beauty in... I, my king, daughter you. of Scotland. So, you... You are of Scottish noble blood. I think I would actually prefer you marry him instead. This way, I don't have to cock-block the other guy. <laughs> and I can still have him be married. Uh, I've got five more turns for that. Let's we'll send you back. Let's we'll send you back. So, we'll send you down here. Uh, I'll have it so this way, also, you're not going to just uh, marry your, um, your cousin. Instead, this guy gets to marry your cousin. Um, so that's what we'll do, because then I can send you over. Uh, two turns, you'll be able to marry into that family tree. Uh, also, can you find me? Nope. <gasps> You're almost there! You're almost there! Aye. I can almost put you out of your goddamn misery, finally! Uh, let's see, over here, what can I do for my assassins? Keep trying to train you guys. You're already at nine, right? Need a second smile. Yeah, you're already at 9. Okay, so we'll go back over here. Again, keep trying to just burn anything and everything that possibly can give public order. Because, like, right now it's at 80. Yeah, still, ha still happy. Although, mm, I don't want to risk it. But, if I assassinate him, if I assassinate him, that will start a war if they find out. But if not, that would also make it so the area would rebel... I don't know, I'll have to see, because I'm tempted to. I'm very tempted. But if I do that, that is most certainly going to start a war if they find out. I have to make sure that we have a like a 75% chance of succeeding or something like that. If we can get that high, then we might be okay, and we might not have to worry about possible ramifications of just straight up war. Also, before I forget, I want to try and see if I take like these four units. If I send you over here, not happy. Okay, just, just want to check. It's at least at 15% now, so it's not that bad. I could also... Go to daily races. That would make it 30%. You'll be at 60% after that. Probably not enough. I'll probably have to bring you back over there uh, for at least a turn, kind of watch over the area. But we'll at least double check and try and see, like, how do they feel about that. Uh, keep recruiting more men around here. We do need to make sure that we have a good amount of men to help in this war. As now we're starting to take some of this land, we need to make sure we have enough men to keep fielding, uh, but keep reinforcing these guys. Ooh, a civil war at Aragon. Interesting. Trade fair, I will gladly offer some money for that, as I am rich as shit right now. Um, Seabus is pissed. That's to be expected. Uh, I'm gonna send you guys back over this way. I'm gonna bring you back over here. I'm gonna have you watch over the city for a time. Um, put you in here. Let's have these guys kind of get out of the city for right now. Uh, basically just put you guys right there. And then I'll put you right here. I, it, I know the main issue is primarily conversion. So if I have it so that right now it's at 45%, I can get rid of this. It was temporary. I was hoping that maybe it would make it so that you guys are happy enough, but they're not. Um, let's repair everything. Although, actually, eh, it's, it's fine. It's fine. Yeah, repair that. Uh, and then I'll have it so that I'll actually probably demolish this building uh, so we don't have the conversion issues. And then focus on converting this area for a little bit. I'm still waiting on those priests. Oh, you're still stuck. I forgot to move you. <laughs> Damn it. Well, keep making your way over here. Uh, the sooner you guys get over there, the better, because I really do need to make sure I have some way to actually convert. And it'll take a while to make sure that this area is happy, um, or like large enough that I can actually recruit priests. Because I have a large enough city, but I just do not have... Um, it's going to take a while to build. Like This takes three turns, six turns, seven turns, and also I need to have a site hut and a stonemason's hut built up to get it, which that's like another 20 turns on top of that, too. But, I think... Uh, let me just double-check a couple more things. And I want to try and see... Ooh, someone died. Who the fuck are you? 
Oh, that's not good. That's not good at all. That was like actually somebody that mattered. Um, can you guys go into Paris and make sure it's happy? No. Okay. Paris is pissed. Uh, Paris is primarily pissed because of Squalor. Okay. Um, the way we can deal with that is... Shit. Oh, actually, no. Yeah, 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 yeah. Uh, get that. That will help uh, make it so there's less growth. But it's not going to help in the meantime. Um, can we watch over the city? Okay. It's good enough now. Uh, you guys can go back to ruin. Nip, fuck! No, it's not. I need those guys to stay around. Okay, so we need to focus on public order for right now. I'm going to have you try and get that. So we just lose more people. Um, and also get some more law bonus there, I would say. Other than that, I do want to just try and again Aye. keep stabbing you. I think you're trying to see here if we can keep sabotaging just everything. Like, if I can, I'm just going to burn the entire city down to effectively to the ground. You seriously, stop failing! There, there, and... There we go. Because they're actually not doing so well with their economy right now. So if I keep burning more things, eventually this area might start burning. Eventually. Um, it's like, what, one more turn with you? Uh, I, I'm going to do one more turn, because I want to at least get you to marry into that family, I'd say. Them, also, we'd then be able to finally kill you off. <laughs> You're like two turns away to be able to properly hit this area, but I can finally put this guy out of his misery, because you, you struggled. You've been walking for years to try and get here. But I think let's do one more turn end, and then I think we'll be done for today. Man, everybody's just now asking me for money now that I'm making so goddamn much. Literally, I'm making 16000 per turn. Um, oh, you won't be able to hit him until next turn. Damn it. Okay. But soon you're, you'll be put out of your misery. But I can at least get you to marry into this family. Now, hopefully, please, have some kids. I want this family tree to continue. Because uh, hopefully, with me like getting this guy killed and some other family members dying soon... Um, there should be more space on the faction tree, and then you'll actually decide to have kids, hopefully. That's my hope, at least. But, um, let's see, Reams. I'm just gonna quickly build some more stuff before I forget. Grab that, I would say, like, a hospital. Why not? Grab that, and then, uh, you got your church here. I'll have it so you need to focus on growth. Actually, lower the taxes there. And kind of don't build anything, but maybe besides, like, blacksmith. But that's, like, about all I can think of for the most part. But I think I'm actually gonna be done for today. It's probably a pretty good place to end this for now. So hopefully you guys enjoyed this. If you guys did, let me know down in the comments down below. I love hearing what you guys have to say about this campaign and any other thoughts you have on it in general. So I hope you guys enjoyed this. This is Rampant, and I'll see you guys next time.